What's up in his house? Sorry, that was a bad impression of uh. Let, let's try that again. Yo, 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 what's up in the his house? Okay, that was a little bit more believable. If you don't know who does that, it's Jay from Jay and Silent Bob. And he says it multiple times. I think his most memorable time saying that is in Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back. Anyways, that's just a little trivia for you. So. Anyways, I'm back, and you know what time it is. It's Metal Gear Solid 5 time. Now, I have done a shit ton of main missions in a row. Like, six of them in a row. So, we need to take a break. We're going to do some side ops. Get caught up on some of those. Because I like the side ops just as much as the main missions. The the story in Metal Gear Solid 5 isn't grabbing me as much as I wanted to. I wanted to grab me and pull me in, but it's just not doing it. And a lot of people say, well, it's because of this, it's because of that. Well, while that may be true, that Konami has kind of altered or fucked up the story that Kojima made. It still doesn't save the story, but, I mean, honestly, I don't know what's going on behind the scenes, so, yeah. Parasite suit is still 32 minutes. Let's see what buddy stuff we got. Yeah, I honestly don't care what she looks like. Um, Alright, so we have one main mission. Uh, remember, it, it ended with to be continued, which is so funny. So it makes you want me to play this next, but I'm not going to play that next. I'm going to do some side ops. Actually, before we do that, let's uh, send some guys on combat missions, because we can again. Yep, okay, so I'm out of guys. Out of places, okay. Alright, let's do some side ops. Uh... Let's see, so should we do, there's side ops for Afghanistan and, Afghanistan and uh, Africa. So which one do, should we do, let's see, so this is a, Africa, we have five in Afghanistan, let's see, let's go to the one we have, uh, so in Afghanistan, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. And you could go around like that, I guess. You could go do, 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 do and hit them all. It really depends, though. Let's see. In Africa, there's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, there's six. Six of them. They're all tightly packed together. Um, it's been a while since I've done Afghanistan, so let's go ahead and do that. We'll start up here. We'll go around in a circle. It's going to be a big circle. We'll end up here, and then we'll go down here to, to clear it all up. Oh, shit. Never mind. Uh, there's one up here, too. So, okay. So let's go ahead and do that. Why the fuck not? Um, so, I need to find this mission. Uh, 
that one. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna start up here, we're gonna arc this huge ass fucking circle around here and then go here. That'll probably take us like two and a half hours, but you know, it'll be fun. So let's go ahead and do that. Cause why the fuck not? So we will start up here and like I said, we'll branch our way around and end up over here, which is way the fuck. So, all right, let's do it. Let's do it. We're gonna change uh, buddies, though. I haven't used my horse in a while, so we're gonna actually. You know, I don't like the D Walker, though. I mean, it's just not grabbing me. Maybe I just need more. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's try something real quick. I, I apologize for keep jumping around like this. Uh, okay. Walker. Fuck me. Now that's cool, high voltage stun gun, but I need a higher security team for all that shit, so. Um, we may want to do this just because um, then we don't have to carry the missile launcher with us. Anti-guided missiles, that's pretty cool. You know what? Fuck it. We don't use the walker that much, even though it's loud as fuck. You know, we'll, we'll try it out. We'll try it out. Oh yeah, that was a uh, contact with him, right? All right, so that's way up there. That's the highest one. Okay, let's we'll start with this one. All right, we'll, we'll try using the walker. Because the walker moves pretty fucking fast. When do I get his headband? Option no none. No fucking headband. You know what? Uh I'm I'm really sorry to keep doing this. I wanna check that out. Why am I uh when do I get my fucking head? Oh no 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 no. When do I get my fucking headband?
I guess I don't know when I'm gonna get a head option, so fuck it, I guess. Okay, I'm sorry for all the fucking around. No more fucking around. We're gonna get this party started. Alright. Okay, let's go. No. We wanna select a uh, primary weapon. We don't need this. Let's choose that. Alright. Let's commence mission. About time, right? 11 minutes in. Jesus Christ. Alright. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to do all the missions, but... We're gonna try our damnedest, that's for sure. It's already 11 p.m., so. And we got a new song. We got a lot of tapes to listen to while we do this shit, so. That'd be funny if the walker was trying to fit in the helicopter. Okay, let's get some tunes on. Or actually, we gotta listen to our tapes first. So we got a lot of fucking tapes. Remember the four of us? Quiet attacked one of our guys on Mother Base. Stuck a knife in his mouth. He's one of the very few soldiers who've had contact with her recently. Close contact. I don't think it's a coincidence that he was among those who became symptomatic pretty early on in this epidemic. Saliva and blood spatter. An open wound. Mucosal infection. Whatever is causing this got inside him then. Miller, that is a baseless accusation. The source of the infection is quiet. Everyone suspects her. We don't know that. And we've come across these symptoms before. The bodies in the water, the old the facility, those sick people in the bed, the devil's house. They're identical to what we've seen while we've been after Cypher. The infection could have come from elsewhere, but at the very least, she does know something. It's not like she's gonna talk. Well, no, not through words, anyway. But what about her actions? Quiet held a knife to the soldier back then, before he became symptomatic. There must have been a reason for that. A reason for shoving a knife down. Boss, get down. The enemy's... Ah! No! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my god. You know what? Fuck the walker. Jesus fucking Christ.
That was kind of pathetic. But all right, um, we'll try it again though. I actually don't need my walker right now. Yeah, actually, my dog's more useful because he can pull the next track. Thank you. 
Roger that. Go get him. Why are you following me? Go fucking get on me, bastard. Fucking dumb dog. Is he faulting on? What? What is? The... Dude, I told you to go faulting on me, you ass. I need my I'm gonna need my horse to get to the next one. You gotta extract him. Bye bye puppy. Okay, let's listen to another tape. Well, we listen to that one. About the pathogen spreading through Mother Base, you've seen everything we've got on the outbreak. What's your opinion? Textbook symptoms. A vocal cord power fight. Infestation. And judging from this casualty list, it is the Kikuma was slain. Meaning, the breed of power height that triggers symptoms upon detecting a pronunciation specific to Kikongo. So our Kikongo-speaking staff are at risk. Quite so. Mm -hmm. He's right. All the victims do speak Kikongo. So they can survive if they just use another language. There is no guarantee you're only dealing with the Kikongo strain. Other language strains may be present. 
What does that mug say? Is it really the only way? Sure, it'll prevent infection from the Doesn't say anything. There's just a random mug in this house. No, no. Tactical communication is a linchpin of what we do. What if we were to ban the use of the Congo? Insufficient. First, there's no guarantee that only the Kikongo strain is here. Second, 